What is going on, guys? Grave here. We're closing in on the end of the Blackwood chapter for this year. Of course, we're going to get a preview for the next update, which will be the quarter four DLC, the small story DLC, which is going to kind of revolve around the Deadlands. We're going to get a preview of that on Friday uh, the 17th. And this kind of already sparked a lot of conversation within the community of what we can expect to see next year. A lot of people have been talking about areas we're going to go to. What this, what's the story going to be? Is Zoss going to continue to do the same trend they've done over the last several years of how they release the DLC throughout the year? And I'm assuming that's probably going to stay. But the biggest uh, kind of topic that I've been seeing going on within the community is kind of people saying they want to see new classes and the other side saying they want to see new weapon skill lines. So it's kind of a divide within the community of what exactly people want to see for content. A lot of people want to see new classes, like I said, and some people want to see just new skill lines added in. And of course, we've gotten two new classes over the last several years. That is the Warden and the Necromancer class. And they have both been really good at times and both been nerfed and buffed and everything kind of in between since their release. And a lot of people think that or a lot of people in the community kind of talk about how they don't want another class considering when you bring a new class out it feels like the other classes are just kind of left you know alone and not really as good as they could be or as good as they were because it feels like you know when a new class is released they want to make that new class really powerful to begin with for people to be able to start using it and i can kind of understand that and i've even heard people go as far as saying they don't want new classes because they feel like it's pay to win i don't agree with that whatsoever but a lot of people have a lot of different feelings when it comes to new classes coming to the Elder Scrolls Online. And of course, it's been several years since we've got a new class. You know, we got the Warden, then they skipped a year, then we got the Necromancer. And I think a lot of people thought that it was going to be just a every, you know, two year kind of thing that we're going to get a new class. And if they did that, we would have so many classes within the next, you know, five, six years that it would be, you know, personally for me, a lot of the older classes would probably be just absolutely useless. And people would only be using the newer classes as long as, you know, they were still strong and not being you know nerfed or changed too much so i understand why some people don't want uh new classes i understand why some people do but at the same time the best thing that i've heard so far has been the new weapon skill lines i think stamina and magic both could use new weapon skill lines and i think this will be something that you could add into the game that would be fun that would be something different that we have not seen yet and I still see that the people, you know, kind of use the same argument for this. Well, if you use new weapon skill lines, the old weapon skill lines will kind of be obsolete. And that is true. That could be the case as well. But I think if they're going to go in a direction of adding content besides just story modes and new zones and things, uh, change it up a little bit. Uh, we've had two new classes, you know, over the last several years. So adding something else in that's different than what we have seen or experienced, I think would freshen the game up some. And I think weapon classes or weapon skill lines would be kind of that thing in my opinion that would freshen the game up get people uh, kind of interested in playing because there's a lot of players out there and I, i'm one of them at times where you know i play the game uh, you know i play the big dlc and some of these smaller dlcs i might not play as much or not at all because you know of course i am doing other videos here on youtube but when i'm just relaxing and playing uh, sometimes you know you you feel like well i played the big story part of the year and, and the rest doesn't really interest me and there's a lot of players out there like that some players only come into the game now and, and play just the big story DLC. So they came in and played the Blackwood chapter. And if they didn't like it, they weren't around long. And they'll wait till next year to the next chapter comes out before they really play the game much again. And I feel like adding something new, like, uh, you know, new weapon skill lines would freshen the game up some. I think it would bring some pe people back to the game that may not have played in a while that may not necessarily come back if it's just a new class. I think a lot of people aren't really interested in new classes as much as they were in the past and i know a lot of newer players uh, talk about new classes a lot and some older veteran players as well but just personally for me I, I think between you know new classes or new weapon skill lines i would prefer zoss to go with the weapon skill line idea maybe update the older weapon skill lines we have now and then add some new ones in and i think that could be a a neat direction to go for you know next year's dlc Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.